Lake Natron, a large saltwater lake situated in northern Tanzania in eastern Africa. Lake Natron is located within the East African Rift Valley, which is a region where the African tectonic plate is splitting into two separate plates, the Nubian Plate and the Somali Plate. The lake covers an area of roughly 1,040 square kilometers and is approximately 50 kilometers long and 22 kilometers wide at its widest point. Lake Natron is primarily located in Tanzania, although a very small portion of the lake extends into Kenya. The lake is relatively shallow, with a maximum depth of around 3 meters. Lake Natron has high level of salinity and alkalinity. The lake's water is highly saline, with salt concentrations that can be more than 10 times salter than seawater. This extreme salinity is primarily due to the evaporation of water in the arid climate, leaving behind concentrated salts. Lake Natron also has high level of alkalinity, its pH level can reach as high as 10.5 to 12, which is far more alkaline than typical freshwater bodies. This extreme alkalinity is a consequence of the high levels of sodium carbonate and other minerals in its water. This high levels of salinity and alkalinity of Lake Natron is primarily because of its location. The lake is located in a hot, arid environment, with temperatures in the water often reaching 40 to 60 degrees Celsius. The high evaporation rates concentrate salts in the lake, contributing to its caustic nature. The lake's alkalinity comes from high concentrations of sodium carbonate and other alkaline salts, that are washed into the lake from the surrounding volcanic rock and ash, particularly from the nearby, Aldoño Lengai volcano, which produces nitrocarbonatite lava, rich in sodium compounds. One of the most striking features of Lake Natron is its distinctive red or pink color. This coloration is a result of the presence of salt-loving microorganisms, such as red-colored bacteria and algae, which thrive in the highly saline and alkaline waters. These microorganisms, along with the dissolved minerals, give the lake its unique hue. The combination of high salinity and alkalinity makes Lake Natron one of the harshest aquatic environments on Earth. However, despite the extreme conditions of Lake Natron, some remarkable organisms have adapted to its high salinity and alkalinity. A few species of fish, specifically adapted to the lake's high alkalinity, are found in the waters around freshwater springs at the edges of the lake. Lake Natron is also a crucial breeding ground for roughly 2.5 million lesser flamingos that lives in the surrounding areas. The high salinity supports the growth of algae, which flamingos feed on. Because of its unique biodiversity, Lake Natron is recognized as a Ramsar site. One of the most famous myths, associated with Lake Natron is that it turn animals that touches it into stone. This myth likely stems from the lake's high levels of sodium carbonate and other minerals, which preserve the bodies of animals that die in or around the lake. When animals die and fall into the lake, its high alkalinity and mineral content can lead to rapid calcification, preserving their bodies in a way that makes them appear almost petrified or stone-like. While they aren't literally turned to stone, their preserved remains look eerily lifelike, leading to the myth that the lake turns creatures into statues.